We are this close to eradicating polio from the face of the earth. When I met with Lois, I discovered that was only one side of the battle. Surviving polio is like winning a battle, but to win the world, Lois Altar has set out to be unstoppable. I was affected by polio when I was two years old. According to the story my mom told me, that I had a fever and I was rushed to the hospital. My temperature was high. After getting to the hospital, I was administered with injection. Then I slept. By the time I woke up, I couldn't get up from the bed by myself. There is no cure for this. It can only be prevented through vaccinations. More than 16 million people are able to work today who have otherwise been paralyzed. So many people who were not so lucky infected with the polio virus, the war continues. But just like Lois, even people infected with polio can still be purposeful. My disability is an opportunity for me to change the world. I set up Cedar Seed Foundation to advocate for the rights of persons with disabilities, particularly polio survivors. So that makes me a problem solver. I have contested for elections in the just concluded primaries. And I have won. Now I'm a candidate and I'm going to meet with others in the 2019 polls. And God's willing, I will win. And when I win, I will become the first woman with disability in the National Assembly.